G'day guys, this is Tia, and welcome back to another Fallout 76 Wastelanders video. Today I'm going to be showing all of you how to acquire and use the Chinese Stealth Armor in Fallout 76. Basically, you will need to have completed three quests before you even get the opportunity to get this. So, keep in mind that you will need to complete these three quest prerequisites first. Firstly, complete the mission where you inoculate the settlers and the raiders. Then, you must complete a quest called the Motherload, which is in the base game of Fallout 76. Then finally, complete the Settlers quest known as Trade Secrets. Once all of these three quests have been done, then return to Foundation, and then locate the person named Jen. She will give you some backstory on the mission, but basically just say whatever you want to her at this point in time, and then proceed down to Vault 76, where you will be going to destroy and then capture a Liberator. Follow the button prompt on screen while looking at the corpse to capture it. Then you must return to Foundation and speak to Jen. She'll be talking with Penelope, and once you put in the Liberator on the desk, they'll begin a long, long drawn out conversation about the mission. So just sift through it and wait for the event to conclude. And once it is concluded, then just talk to Jen. Then fast travel to the White Springs Golf Club. Once you're at the White Springs Golf Club, just follow the quest marker to a place called the Seventh Hole. Once that is done, just follow the Liberator to its designated location which is a hatch leading to a place called The Deep. Enter it, make your way to the control room, and make sure you kill every single communist son of a bitch on your way down. Enter the control room and locate the spy, deal with the situation in any way you want. I got the armor and I let her mother live, so just deal with it in any way you say fit. Now, you'll need to allow Jen a little bit of time to deal with the situation that just happened with her mother, but after some time has passed, return to her at Foundation and you'll have finished the mission and acquired the Chinese Stealth Armor plans. You can now craft this at any workbench. It might actually be really useful for a Berserker's build if you craft a low, low level version, so keep that in mind as well. But the level 50 variant gives you 140 damage and energy resistance respectively. Also 1000 radiation resistance tacked on, which is pretty insane. Now it also comes with three legendary effects, an improved chameleon effect where you stay invisible even whilst you're moving, which is awesome, fuck yes. You also take less fall damage, which is alright I guess, cool. And you no longer contract diseases from water and air, again. Alright, that helps, cool. Now this does come from the bodysuit, you don't need to wear the helmet, the helmet is entirely there for looks, and offers no in-game benefits. It is worth mentioning that these two items cannot be dropped or traded, so whatever character you get this on is where it's staying. And that's going to do it for me guys, I hope this guide helped out a lot. As always, a massive thank you to my channel members. I cannot thank you guys enough, it truly means the world. Be sure to follow me on all my social medias and join my Discord, all of which will be linked down below in the description. If you enjoyed the video and want to see more from me, then consider subscribing. My name is Tia, and I'll catch you in the next one. Welcome to Valhalla.